Oh, good afternoon. Um, I'd had a problem yesterday and the day before with number 20 not lighting and I thought it was a wick problem but then I thought oh I'll have a look and actually the chicken feeder was blocked so there was no fuel actually getting to the, the burners. So you'll see in the first couple of shots that the tender top was on which didn't help at all so it's back on and I did do a run with the tender top off and she was running like a bat out of hell so I decided that I didn't want to get a load of carriages out so I put a, a temporary load on the back and you'll see that uh, this uh, five litre container of water is sitting sort of neatly upright here and uh, so that was fine for the, the first run around but I thought I'd probably need to give her a little bit more go which I did, you'll probably see me giving her a bit more go which promptly on the curve that she's approaching now, Willow Curve East uh, she promptly chucked the 5 litre container of water off and uh, and the wagon as well and the, the water container went onto the ground and the wagon at the side of the track so you'll see, this is me giving it just a little bit more go it's a very powerful little engine and does go like the clappers and you'll see very shortly in the next sort of clip fade that uh, she's running with the the water load changed <laughs> so, <laughs> less top heavy there we are hope you enjoy a uh, successful steam test and everything else and uh, I'm so pleased it wasn't the wicks thanks very much indeed Thank you for watching. You can see me fiddling a bit with the regulator in these early stages because she does go like the clappers. The other thing is I've got a, a, Morning. a tight spot at the bottom end, you know, which is annoying. An idea that the, the, the shaft itself might be a little bit skewed.